Time for Success with Cess. Hello, everybody, and welcome again to Success with Cess, where we help you make your dreams come true. Today, uh, post-Valentine's Day, happy belated Valentine's Day to everybody. And today's guest is Shelly Barndollar with Show Homes Houston. And before we talk to Shelly, remember the show is brought to you by the Guerra Group, where we help you make your real estate dreams come true. And Shelly and Pratt Barndollar with Show Homes Houston also help make dreams come true through their marvelous and wonderful staging work. Yeah, so Shelly, tell us a little bit about yourself and uh, how, uh, how it's going. All right. Well, thank you for having us on. Me on. Yeah. I guess there's not an us here today. Just me. My other half is at home working diligently. Um, but thank you for having us on, Sess. Of and course. I have on my Valentine's shirt today. Yes. So happy Valentine's Day belated for everybody. Hope you Absolute, got lots of chocolate. Absolutely. And, hearts yes, to you. Yes. Hearts, hearts. And hopefully you all got fat. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, we've known each other for a long time. You guys helped us with our personal house in Tanglewood yeah. a few years ago, and uh, we had a great outcome. And so and it was a beautiful house. Yes, it was gorgeous. Yes. Lots of work. Uh, it was, and that experience was something, it was amazing because after you were done, uh, Laura came into the house and saw some things. Or where did you find this? Right. Oh, it was in the front room. Was just... It was so funny because we were just talking about that. Laura, after we finished, and it took us, you know, a couple of days to get everything, the whole house ready and prepared. And then Laura sends a picture of this table, this side table. And she goes, Shelly, oh my God, I love this table. Can I buy it? <laughs> And I said, Laura, it's yours. <laughs> so everybody gets used to having things in certain places and you don't pay attention to what you have after a while. Yes. And so it's kind of like walking over the same stain in your carpet that you've seen for five years. Yeah. And so yeah. you don't pay attention to it anymore. Right. And so our job is to basically come in and give you the ideas of things that need to be done before you list your property, um, whether it's replacing your carpet or new lighting or just simple things that are easy to do right. to your home um, before you list it. But we also, you know, with Sess, we and Laura, we offered the service of where we could come in and do um, basically a restyle. And using your furniture and a little yeah. bit of supplemental that we brought in, which wasn't a lot, because you guys had so many beautiful things that we were able to just kind of transform it to uh, what everybody would want to see when they walk into the house and, and right. buy your beautiful property. Right. Uh, I heard you say something about, you know, uh, the stain that it's there, but you don't see it. It's kind of like the forest for the trees yeah. because you're in there every day. You just don't right. don't see the, the, the way things kind of. Yeah. might appear to a, a potential buyer. Right, right, exactly. And, you know, it goes for a lot of things like smells. Um, that's yeah. something that's a really difficult thing for uh, somebody to bring up to a client. Right. And if you, you know, having that smell, you're in the house all the time. You, you no longer pick up those things that you're used to seeing. You're used to that smell, right. maybe of pet odor. You have dogs, you have cats, whatever, or even just cooking smells. You know, according to market research, uh, odors is the number one reason that uh, a potential buyer will not buy a house. And it could be yep. smoke, yeah. mildew, pet dander, yep. um, uh, the smell of, of, of certain foods, right. what have you, yep. um, that uh, will will drive a buyer away. Yeah, so that that is definitely when we go into a house, whether it's vacant or occupied, that's the first thing that, that I look for or smell for. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, you know, you have to bring it up tactfully, but the, the seller has to... To be aware of these things, that's going to drive your buyers away. So that that's right. really a right. critically right. important thing to bring up. Um, so so tell us a, a little bit uh, about the process from from the beginning to the end. Okay, 
So it, it, um, it varies a little bit from if it's a, a vacant staging. Um, Pratt and I own Show Homes Houston, as Seth said, and so uh, we've been working at this for about five years now. So, and we met you in the very beginning. Right, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah um, we sure did. So we've known each other a long time, but um, so if it's a, it's a vacant staging, what we need to do is, is see the property. Typically, we like to see it. Uh, and then we can provide um, a proposal. Uh, if it works, um, then it, it's basically a matter of just getting the date down. I do um, a design for each home. Every home is different. Um, and because every home is different, I don't want to bring something that was in another house and think that it's going to work in your house. Right. So every house is different. I do a separate design for each and every house. Uh, we have about 30 homes of inventory now so we've grown right. quite a lot and um, so we go from that point to preparing the house preparing the design we bring it in set it up and it's right. it's you know uh, we've had tremendous success and we've we've actually been able to to do a graph this year of right. the last several years right and seeing what difference show homes can make as opposed to leaving your house vacant or even using another staging company bingo bingo that that is is such uh, an important point and um i i will say when, when we go in for the listing appointment on our end and and kind of evaluate the home and start addressing the factors that are going to help the uh seller sell the house uh staging is usually a um uh, an issue or a point that we bring up and uh there there seems to always be some mis misconceptions yeah, i think i think i think, so, I think. Yeah. what what do you think uh are, are the biggest misconceptions you come up with so what uh, there's a lot of people that don't even know what staging is still and it's amazing to me when i i come across this but there are people that are like staging. That's actually a thing. Yes, that's a big thing. Yes, and yes, a but big thing. but a lot of people are under this misconception that it's really expensive, like really really expensive, and and there's there's varying levels of staging services. Right. Um. All the way from a simple consultation, which is typically around two hundred dollars. Um, so that's not an expensive thing. It goes for about two hours and we go through the whole house and and talk to the homeowner about things that need to be done to market that home and right. make it sell faster. Um, but the, the, the biggest misconception, I think, is that vacant staging is expensive. And if you look at your first price drop, vacant staging is so reasonable compared to your first price drop. Yes, yes. Uh, I uh, I use these words uh, often with various things is you're going to pay for it one way or the other. Exactly. Whether it's through the price drop or yeah. w whether you stage it with some staging, right. uh, pro uh, appropriate staging, right. and get a faster result. Exactly. Yeah. Because staging, um, home staging has been shown even by NAR to sell homes 60 to 80% faster right. than a vacant home. Right. Um, and, and our results line up with that, uh, Show Homes Houston. And so the, the other thing to keep in mind is that it's not just your price drop that that that, that seller is, is eating that money but also all their carrying costs. What's their ROI? Right, and right. you know, their carrying costs of their electric, an empty home, they have a mortgage, they have their HOA, HOA fees, yeah, yeah. they have all of the expense of carrying that home each and every month. Yes. As yes. opposed to staging it, right, the house sells right. in one to two months maybe, as opposed to six months right, or, or right, longer. Right, you right. Know. You know, and, and it is, always the, the 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 consumer's choice consumer's decision whether they hire you or not right. and 
and we've we've worked together on various projects mm-hmm. and 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 in my consultations with the sellers uh, I recommend at least visiting and, and meeting with you mm-hmm. uh, and, and we've had varying degrees of success um, from the, the clients that have not utilized your services to the clients that have Right. And and so just from uh, the personal experience that I have, I, I would say it's one hundred percent true, and um, uh, I, I can think of one case in the uh, the Rice Military area where the 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 seller could have utilized your services right. early on and chose not to, yeah. and ended up you know taking the, the price. Did you remember yeah. that? Yeah. 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 yeah definitely. And, you know, that's what, that's what we have been tracking over the last couple of years is not only homes that, uh, that we staged that were successful, but we're keeping an eye on all the homes that were, st- were staged by somebody else mm-hmm. or were not staged, show homes maybe were called in, they got a quote from us. Our success over the people that chose to go with somebody else right, or right. not at all is yeah. phenomenal. And right. we've got those, those, yeah. you know, we've got the records to prove that now. Tell so. us a little bit about your crew. You said you've got like a 30 homes worth. Of, yeah. yeah, yeah we, give us a little yeah. background on, on, on your operations. So we have, um, you know, 30 homes of furniture basically. And, um, right now it's just super hot out there and I'm finding that, you know, I mean, it's a very hot market right now anyway in certain, you know, certain price points. But what we're finding is that when we are staging, holy cow, we we just got an offer on a house with an, under 12 hours oh, the other day. Go back in and destage it. I know. Now I got to pull it out. So I was like, ah. But um, so we've, you know, we've been doing this, you know, as I said, for five years. We started with five houses of furniture and now we're up to 30. And so it's, it's a, it's, it's a growing company. We love it. We yes. just are yes. so yeah. excited about it. Yes. And, yeah. you know, Pratt is, is kind of the behind the scenes guy yes. and he takes care of all my clients. And, and then we have Junie who joined us a couple of years ago and Junie does a phenomenal job. She's our, our VP marketing and she reaches yeah. out and gives, gives some touches to all our clients. Um, and we our our big uh, goal is to make sure that every one of our clients is taken care of. Um, we don't just place furniture in a house. Our goal is to make sure we help market your house. Yeah. So we yeah. we will post that on all of our social media. Yeah. So we kind of see ourselves as not just staging, uh, but marketing. Partners. I, partners. I think you really uh, you yeah. form a partnership with yeah. not only the realtor but the the client and and um, so there is that uh, win win attitude right. that that permeates the the transactions. Right. So, and if you've got everybody yeah. working for you, it is a win win. It's like a team. you're working, we're working, the homeowners working. Yep. And and yep. it does. It actually yep. creates this really great. A working environment that mm-hmm. we can get that house sold quicker mm-hmm. for them. That's that's right, folks. So um, you know, if you're interested in, in in selling your home, it is a hot market. There is uh, a, a a low supply of inventory out there. High demand uh, driven by uh, low interest rates, and uh, just as uh, Shelley said. So how how do the folks get in touch with you? So uh, they can get in touch with us on uh, Show Homes Houston. Dot com. Okay. They can find us there. They can look at our website. We are also um, on House H O U Z Z dot com. Right. They can find Show Homes Houston on House. They can call us at 832-289-7513. All right. You got it. We'll post it right up there for the viewers to see. Thank you. Thanks for joining us the day after Valentine's Day. Bye. Shelly, thank you for being here. You're welcome. Thank you for having us. Have a great day, everybody. Bye.